Hi, I'm Rich Brown for CNET, and I'm here with the Sony VAIO TAP20 all-in-one desktop. So this system might be the most unique in the entire slate of Windows 8 launch PCs. What's interesting about it is that while it's a 20-inch all-in-one that has a fairly modest set of components, it actually also has a battery. What that means is that you can take this system and move it around anywhere in your house, and it really kind of straddles the line between desktop and tablet. So for its core specs, it's a 20-inch display with a 1600 by 900 resolution. It comes with a Core i5 low-voltage CPU, as well as 4 gigs of RAM and a 750 gigabyte hard drive. It has onboard Intel graphics, so it's not really much of a gaming desktop. And it actually only has a fairly limited set of ports. You get a couple USB 3s, some audio jacks, an SD card slot, as well as standard Ethernet and power. That's about it. Sorry, Home Entertainment Hub fans, it does not have an HDMI input, which is kind of a drag. We also found in our testing that the system will last for about three and a half hours on battery. That's certainly long enough to watch most movies. So with those specs and for $9.99, this might seem like an overpriced desktop. But the battery really gives it some unique flexibility. You pick it up pretty easily close up the stand and take it pretty much wherever. You can lay it down flat on a surface or you can take it and move it into say a bedroom, a den, or somewhere sort of out of the way to use it as a full screen computer for watching movies or browsing the web or whatever you want to do on it. So for movie watching it has no optical drive so you're stuck with either an external optical if you want to kind of clutter it up or whatever you can get from the web or it's on your hard drive. And as I said with gaming you can play newer titles with lower image quality settings but I wouldn't expect to play everything. For general day-to-day -day computing, though, you can do pretty much anything you want in the system as long as you steer clear of higher-end multimedia editing. It also has some unique networking capabilities in that it has Wi-Fi, Bluetooth 4.0, and NFC support. So the system definitely is not for everybody. I can certainly see an argument that a laptop or a tablet can do pretty much anything this thing can for a lower price and it's easier to move around. Still, the fact that this brings a nice large display and a battery-powered PC makes it kind of compelling for a certain niche. So I'm Rich Brown. This is the Sony VAIO TAP20.